POV by me. We're driving down an old cemetery in Slavic Village, Cleveland, Ohio, March 19th, 2023. This neighborhood has been around since 1799. This neighborhood was the, like the, the absolute center of that crash. Um, it was, there's been articles written about it, about how this was basically ground zero. The most foreclosures of any zip code in all of the United States. Uh, pretty staggering. Pretty staggering. So you can imagine what kind of hurt that brought on the people here. And how it affected the local economy. How it elect, uh, affected the crime of this neighborhood. All that stuff. Nothing, nothing good came of it. And so, if you were to come here at night, you would see some bad stuff going on. You would see some really bad stuff going on on some of these streets. Because I've driven through this neighborhood at night, and you don't want to get a flat tire. 2 a.m. in this neck of the woods. But this is Cleveland. This is America. 2023. Malibu Joe's. One, two, three. Quick stop. Look at this. This street is named Krakow. This is how. Uh, this is this is still part of Slavic Village. This is still. They have street names, you know, named after these ethnic peoples. Kazimir. There's another Polish. You know, look, there's little bars. Look, little little bar. Little rest. Oh no, it's a hair hair cutting place. Um, where should we go? Let's take a right.
construction site. Jesus. Alright. Let's go this way. So Cleveland is to the left. Cuyahoga Heights is to the right. We're leaving the beautiful city of Cleveland and going into a neighboring neighboring town. Again, as you can see, what we have here is just a bunch of industrial streets, industrial buildings, because Cleveland was an industrial hub in the 30s, in the 40s, in the 50s, in the 60s. Factories everywhere. Communities everywhere. And in the 80s and the 90s, boom. Everything's over. Goodbye and good luck. So, you know, you got devastation. So we're entering a kind of nicer neighborhood, as you can see, clean. It's still not the best, but it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Some guy jogging. What is this? Is this some sort of school? Yeah, Cuyahoga Heights School. I feel like this is uh, like a, one of those high schools and um, and uh, elementary, all kind of um, stacked into one. That's kind of what it feels like. Because when I lived in a small town. I worked in a small town in Ohio. They had one giant building for like the K through 12. One giant building.
you I think I've actually been there for a job or two. Yeah, I think I have. Huh. Janitorial Services Inc. on the left. Wow. Don't know what that is. Buckeye Terminals LLC. What the hell is all this? It's fenced in. Seems like there's a lot of uh, like city wide places here, like city resources. That's an aerospace company. What is it called? TMS International. No clue what that is. go in and get a beer what do you guys think yeah yay yay or nay
Alright, peace out. Subscribe.